we're going to get to the dressing now for the potato salad. Um, if you hear a noise in the background, that's just a fan. It's 105 degrees here today, so it's really hot, and I need the fan in the kitchen. All right, so let's get the um, dressing ready for the potato salad. I'm going to use mayonnaise, mustard, um, apple cider vinegar, sugar, and my secret ingredient is sour cream. Oh, and some dill. Okay. All right. So. I don't measure and you can use whatever uh, mayonnaise you like. That one's empty. Open this one. Okay, so here's how I decide how much mayonnaise and dressing to make. I look at how many potatoes I have. Um, that seems to be quite a bit, so maybe about enough for about four to six people so I'm going to use about a cup cup and a half of mayo okay so that's about a cup and a half of mayonnaise Shake up the mustard. You can use any mustard you want. This is what I'm using today. That's about two tablespoons of mayonnaise. I mean mustard. Mix it up a little bit before you add all the other ingredients so you can kind of get a gist uh, you pour too much mustard in there or if it's just right. I'm going to test it now with my impeccably clean fingers and it's perfect. Okay, now that that's all mixed up, let's add some sugar and the vinegar. Now this is just to taste, so I put in about a tablespoon of sugar, mix it up, give it the old test. Delicious. Yep. 
and I'm gonna pour probably just about a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. You can use whatever kind you like. Try not to splash it everywhere. Give it a taste test. Make sure you mix it up real good. Here's a tip that might help you out. Once you've mixed the sugar and the vinegar in with the mayo and the mustard, let it sit for about five minutes so the sugar has time to dissolve in the liquid and then stir it around again and then taste test it to see what it needs. Does it need more vinegar? Does it need more sugar? Or does it need nothing? That's a good tip from me to you. Next, I'm going to add the sour cream and the dill. That was probably about two tablespoons of sour cream. Now you don't need much. I put the sour cream in there so if your potatoes are not completely cool, the mayonnaise will not suck up all, or the potatoes will not suck up all of the mayonnaise um, and leave your potatoes uh, dry. So that's why I add just a little bit of sour cream. Plus it makes it creamy. Now for the dill. I like to use fresh dill, but this dill I got from the freezer. I like to freeze my herbs that way I can take my time using them. That's done. Now I can toss this. If you do buy this kind, you can grow it, but I just throw it in the freezer and I use it as I need and then toss the rest.
it still seems a little bit soggy from the moisture of the freezer so I'm gonna squeeze some of the moisture out of it so it doesn't get the potato salad all soggy there we go Add a little bit of garlic salt and some pepper. Okay, the dressing is done. Now we add it to the potatoes. spoon and now it's time for the celery and onion let's get those chopped up Now that all the ingredients is in here, it's time to mix one last time.
voila! And there you have delicious potato salad ready for your picnic anytime. Thanks for watching. Thank <laughs> you.